one, cohorts work. Uh, it's not just the moral support, it's also actually sharing lots of expertise from their different areas. For example, uh, one project has helped all the other projects doing podcasting um, to help them with their marketing. And one of the other projects has moved their blockchain expertise and given it as a new idea for one of the others. So cohorts are fantastic. Secondly, role models are crucial. Everyone gets inspired by someone else, something that makes the penny drop for them. Uh, we had lots of different role models on the program, but perhaps the one that really triggered the spark for a lot of people was Ruth Daniels from the In Place of War program. Uh, her work basically using creative arts uh, in post-conflict zones was hugely inspirational to a lot of the cohort. My third one would be start the market validation as soon as possible. Just as no plan uh, survives first contact, no business model quite survives the first conversation with the customer. Do that as early as possible. I'm most excited about seeing the teams present in November. Um, the teams came from lots of different subject areas and they had very different starting points, but they've all made enormous strides. And I think that will all be on show at the November Showcase of Ben. It will also be a fantastic demonstration of social science impact in action. My three big takeaways. Firstly, I mentioned talk to customers as early as possible, but talking to stakeholders is just as important. If you're working in local government, you need to speak to the person there that works with innovation. And if you're working, for example, in the healthcare sector, it's critical to find out what the pathways for innovation to go into the healthcare sector are. And that person can often refer you on to really important conversations to help you develop your venture. My second big learning would be that you need multiple role models and mentors. For all the projects, we had the technology transfer manager, we had the speakers, we had the management team of Sam and myself and Don, but we also provided specific mentors who could be another channel for people to voice their concerns and go over problems with. And you need that broad support to make sure everyone can ask the questions that they might not be comfortable asking other people with and get the insight that helps the penny drop. Final big takeaway is the importance of collaboration. For the technology transfer managers, We've all learned a huge amount from each other. Working on the same projects together means we get to pool expertise and see how different technology transfer managers approach problems. But we've also done more specific things like sharing contacts that we have from our networks to help someone else's project. Collaboration among the technology transfer managers is in everyone's interest and has been fantastic to see.